Hi, this is Cameron Brown, Client Success Manager for Business Impact, and today I'm going to show you the benefits of gathering and analyzing your market basket data. For those who aren't familiar with the term market basket, it is simply the contents and price of each consumer transaction. Convenience store owners can use market basket information to create promotions, to group products, and to analyze distributor data. Having the ability to quickly and easily look at the size, content, and value of the market basket helps us understand which products are consistently purchased together and to see what's trending. The market basket data allows us to drill down into customer buying patterns over time to precisely target specific combinations of products, departments, brands, categories, subcategories, and even time of day. This gives us a number of insights such as how to group items typically bought together in the same physical area in the store, how to target promotions more precisely, and how to determine more accurate item pricing for specific stores. So what I've created here is a market basket analysis showing total basket sales, basket count, and average price per basket. On the left we see it broken down by store, and on the right broken down by product categories. I've applied a filter that shows only the baskets that included a Coke product in the purchase. So here we're looking at only the products that accompany the purchase of a Coke product. Here you can see that the total average basket is $6.05, but the total across our company varies greatly from $8.50 down to $4.85. So we see right off the bat there must be a much larger set of underlying circumstances that affect our total basket size and combination of products purchased. So let's say we're looking to create a promotion that pairs a Coke product with another item. Once the filter for all Coke products is applied, we can see which additional product is most often purchased with a Coke item. Now we see that cigarettes have the highest sales, but we realize that cigarettes are a top dollar item and we're interested more in products that have the highest quantity purchased. So let's switch our measure over to the basket quantity. Once we make the switch, we see that salty snacks jumps up to be the category that is most bought with a Coke product. Potato chips is our highest seller in that category and it looks like Lay's Classics hit the top of the product list. As you can probably tell, there's an infinite number of ways to analyze and interpret your market basket data, and with it you can help your marketing executives understand what products are moving faster at each location and equip your team to strengthen their negotiating position with vendors by providing them with better information about customer buying behavior. For more information on our BI solution for convenience stores, check out our website or contact Eric Wenham at the information provided here.